guys, so today's video is going to be a back to school makeup tutorial and this is a very natural one. You can only just get away with wearing a slight bit, if not hardly look like any. Here I'm just going to pin in my hair and please start with a fresh face because it gives a flawless finish. Oh guys, thank you so much for 100 subscribers. And this is the Nivea Daily Ex Essentials Express Hydration Primer and I'm just dotting this all over my face and guys, Every subscriber means everything to me. Thank you so much. I've had like the best week of my life. And I'm just going to blend this. Sorry if you keep seeing me look to the side. It's just hard to know whether everything's b blended from the viewfinder. So I keep looking in my mirror. And then I'm going to be taking my Royal Kabuki brush. And my Rimmel Wake Me Up foundation in shade Ivory. This is a really good one actually guys. And I'm just applying this to my finger um, because I find it better than applying it back to, to the back of my hand because it's more, um, just doesn't soak up as much product really so you don't waste it. Then after I've applied it to my brush I'm just blending this all over my face um, and I kind of stipple it in the T-zone because I get a little spotty around there and I don't like it to look cakey. Also, guys, I have a blog now, um, so I'll link it down below. Uh, and this is just a Samantha Chapman brush. And I'm applying my Rimmel Wake Me Up to this too, and I'm just using this as a concealer. Using the same product twice does give um, you a quick, easier morning. And it looks more natural, this way. Just apply it on any blem blemishes as well, because it really helps. Yeah, so this is just a setting brush. This is the only Samantha Chapman brush I have that I really want to collect them all eventually. Then we need to say, and this is my accessorised um, powder. This is really good. And it really sets your makeup and leaves a long lasting finish without it looking cakey. I hate powder, but it's the only thing that keeps my makeup on, so this is really good for that. And I'm just taking my Royal Kabuki again and blending this on anywhere I get super oily. Um, I'm focusing on the, them areas, but apart from that, just applying it all over my face as you would do. Then this is the Collection Press Powder and my Calvin Klein bronzing brush or whatever brush, I think it's a bronzing brush and I'm just applying this after making a fish face and applying it under my neck as well because I've got kind of a double chin <laughs> and then continuing with the 3E method I prefer to do it in these steps but if you just prefer to do it as a straight 3E please do that you can add and take away to these products. This is the Maybelline Baby Lips and this is in Pink Punch and it smells fantastic. I just apply this onto my lips and I use it also as a cheek stain. It just gives a rosy glow and it's fantastic when your lip and cheek colour are the same. There you go. And then I forgot to fill in my eyebrows so I'm just going over using the Collection Press Powder again and filling them in with kind of like a brow brush thank you though guys I really appreciate everyone subscribing this is the scandalized um, Rimmel Mascara in shade 00 black <laughs> the wrong way but as you do but I forgot my eyelash curler so wait a second <laughs> First of all, you need to curl your lashes to leave a long lasting curl. If your eyelashes stay curled anyway, you really just can skip this step. And then I'm going to be applying this. Um, I don't do it any special way. I found a more of a better way for me to apply this mascara, but this is the most natural way. And I can't really wear makeup to school, so this is a really good, like, natural look. but you can add and take away any products and mix and match them
If you've got any requests, just leave them down below. I would love to read them. And there you go. That's the finished makeup look. I hope you like it. It's quite natural, but I really do like it. And just to finish it off, I'm going to apply a cute, well, I'm going to add a cute bow to the look and put it in my hair. There you go. Thank you for watching, guys. Love you all. Thank you so much for subscribing. It means a lot. If you want me to check out any channels, please leave it down below. Bye-bye. Love you.